Joan, can you talk to us first of all about Pieta House and the work that they do? Pieta House offers the most amazing service to people who are in distress. That's people who may be suicidal or self-harming. And in fact, Pieta House is there at the cliff edge. We're there when someone has attempted suicide but survived, but more than likely will go on to take their lives again. And we are there to listen to their reasons, but also to give them reasons why they should live. You're working now with the IRFU on a campaign called Mind Your Buddy. Can you explain a little bit about how that campaign will work? Mind Your Buddy is part of a bigger program. We have uh, organised a campaign called Mind Our Men because every single week 10 people die by suicide and 8 of them are men. So out of this campaign we've created Mind Your Buddy. This is where we educate people all the, the signs and symptoms of suicide but at peer level. So people in clubs like the IRFU will know what to look for amongst their peers and be able to be that link between the person who's in distress and Pieta House. So with Mind Your Buddy, you're looking at people who are icons to younger kids to in, in a club scenario um, where people look up to other people, look up to their coaches, look up to their peers, look up to their players. Um, that's exactly what we're trying to launch here today. That again, it's just a helping hand that it's going to be now be made more available. There's going to be coaching from uh, Pieta House. Um, so people who are going to take up the Mind Your Buddy campaign, they're going to be trained, they're going to know what to do, they're going to know what signs uh, to look for in players. You know, again, it doesn't even have to be a player. It can be someone outside the rugby scenario. It can be anybody. It can be your brother, your sister, anybody like that. Um, you know, and just anybody who is thinking of doing it, please do it. You know, it'll make such a huge difference. And if today's uh, launch helps one person, then it's that one person again. It's a big difference. I think when you form close bonds and stuff like that with your teammates and stuff, they're the first point of contact really where when you know if you're not feeling right or feeling down and um, they're the first ones that will really notice it. So I think it will benefit people a lot. Um, look, I think I suppose it's, it's always about the physical activity and, and trying to stay physically fit but I think our own mental health is really important and it's something that's become very prevalent in recent years and I think that this body system will help to you know, alleviate that and, and, and you know, let people know they're not alone. It's a fantastic initiative that the IRFU have really, you know, grabbed both hands and, and allows people to show they're not by themselves and, you know, that there is somebody there to talk to and that, you know, they're not, they're not alone. If you're, if you're in a club and you're interested in, in uh, getting involved in it, I think you should because it's um, being able to sort of help somebody out uh, with a bit of men mental issues, uh, just even for a chat is, is probably one of the most important things you can do. As I said, it's becoming more open. Nobody's going to uh, fault you for speaking out about certain things, and um, especially for guys who want to get interested in it in clubs, uh, it's it's going to be in all clubs across Ireland, and um, it's 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 definitely something that's uh, I think I'm looking forward to getting involved in, and it's really important for um, um, players and and people alike.